Hey guys, what's happening? So, I don't think I've, well, I haven't posted a video on the, the first one when you're buying this, but this is my offer up. $150 uh, score. So it's a mini lathe. Um, so if you guys aren't familiar with the mini lathes, um, yeah, it's pretty notorious that these handles kind of suck here. Um, yeah, they're just hard to deal with. So, uh, I designed some handles. Let me show you. Alright, so since I fix 3D printers, I have lots of ball bearings and stuff. So, instead of back to body ball bearings, I add some M5 ball bearings in here. So, here is the part. Uh oh, this one didn't work right. Alright, so these actually handles are garbage. Um, even though they twist off, they're just they're hard because, because they don't spin around. They have to spin in your hand. And, I mean, it gets pretty annoying pretty fast. So, uh, last night I designed some ball bearings. I went through my box, found some M5 ball bearings, and, uh, yeah, just runs some of these, uh, right there, they're called flange washers. Um, I mean, probably could have used smaller washers, I could have made the handle smaller, but I kind of want the bigger handle to spin around, so. Put links down below, um, I think on first page where these will be at. Um, actually, I think once I get this thing up and running, I might make some metal ones. But, I don't know, we'll see. I mean, I do like the ball bearings. The ball bearings are going to make it better, so... Let me get this on real fast. Probably use some blue Loctite on there. I guess when I designed this, I didn't realize that the smaller one was actually smaller. I mean, same size Thread 5, M5. But, the thing is shorter, so I might design another one that's shorter. Yeah, that's a huge improvement. The fact that it spins freely on its own makes it so much more comfortable to spin it back and forth. Way better. Alright, so I'm going to just actually, instead of actually design, well, this one because it failed, the print half, failed halfway. The print that was shorter. I guess I could just use it for this one right here. Or design, design a shorter one. Yeah, the I think it's smaller because it doesn't interfere with this thing right here, the, the back uh, tailstock. Alright, so I designed a smaller one from the back. So it's the same thing, it uses the same, same uh, bearings. It's just smaller in diameter and not as long. To fit back here. Nice, right, the background noise. Nice and smooth ball bearings. It's hard to get the angle right in this one. Um, okay. Nice. Hey, right, if you want them, think of this page. Also, put a link where you can get the bearings too. Awesome.